Say hi from Cherish Math. This is the question. Six circles are inscribed in an equilateral triangle, each with radius of one unit. Find the perimeter of the equilateral triangle. For the solution of this question, I'm going to use a rather different approach. First, connect from the center of this circle to the point of tangent and from the point of tangent to another circle here, the center, and finally center to the center. This is the point of the tangent, and this is going to form a right angle. The radius is given as one unit. And from this point to this point, center to center, that means I'm going to sum up the radius by 1 plus 1 and I get 2. For this vertical line, I find it by using Pythagoras theorem. That is the square root of 2 square minus 1 square. So the answer I'm getting here is the square root of 3. For the vertices here, it's going to be made up of 60 degrees. Simply because this is an equilateral triangle. I'm going to use a 180 degrees divided by 3, and this is 60 degrees. I am going to make another triangle connecting from the top of the vertex to the center and to the point of tangent. And this triangle is going to form 90 degrees over here. While for this part, this is going to be slashing 60 degrees into half and I get 30 degrees. So by using these supplementary angles, this is going to be 60 degrees. Looking back to this blue triangle, since I have all the relevant sides line, and I can come to conclude that this is special angle. This is going to be 30 degrees, and this is going to be 60 degrees. And it fulfill the special angles of a trigonometric. And now, by comparing the red and the blue triangle, these two are identical or congruent to each other. And I can label here as one unit for the radius. And for this vertical length, this is going to be two units according to this one. While for the side length here is going to be the square root of three. For the side length, square root of 3 is going to apply over here. And I'm going to label this square root of 3 as well. For the next step, I'm going to connect from the center to the center of this circle. And this distance is 2 units by combining 2 radii of the circles. And from the center to another center here, that consists of another 2 units, which means the total length of this green line is going to be 4 units altogether. I'm going to pick up this green line and place it here, and this is exactly 4 units. I'm going to label with 4 here. So for the entire side length for one part of this equilateral triangle, that is going to be the square root of 3 plus 4 plus the square root of 3. This is for one side, and I have to multiply by 3 simply because in an equilateral triangle, that consists of 3 sides. And the answer that I'm getting here is 6 square root of 3 plus 12. And I solved the puzzle. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe.